Good morning to you. Happy Friday. A little taste of early winter like weather with temperatures down in the 40s this morning. Wind chill values already dropping into the 30s. The wind is going to decrease later on today. The clouds also start to break up late today. Once the sky clears out, the wind drops off. Those are those ideal conditions we need to see the temperature drop a lot overnight tonight, and it will do so. First freeze on the way for, to the, for tonight, and it will continue over the weekend as well. Wichita Falls right now, it's 47 degrees, dew point 37. Look at that wind from the north northeast up around 20 to 25. Five miles an hour. It will drop off late today, but especially for the morning hours, that wind is going to cut into you. Uh, for Veterans Day, thank you so much to all you veterans out there who have served our country, continue to serve our country. Thank you so much. My dad's a, a, a Vietnam vet as well, and um, so I, I know I, I get it. And um, it's it's on. It's an honor to uh, work alongside you to. Uh, also, just let you know, say thank you for all the service you've done for us and our country. Appreciate it so much. It's going to be cloudy. I wish the weather was better for your day today, but unfortunately, it's not. Cloudy, cold, windy, temperatures mostly in the 40s the entire day. First freeze on the way for the night tonight. It is going to stay below normal now, likely all the way through Thanksgiving. Of course, got Friday night football games going on as well. Kickoff temperature around 41 by the fourth quarter, 39 degrees. We'll see a decrease in the cloud cover, gradual decrease in the wind, but that wind is going to bite, especially for the first half of the game. It does drop off to about 10 to 15 miles an hour by the fourth quarter. Freeze warning in effect across the vast majority of Texoma. So, yes, area-wide at our first freeze coming up today. Look at current temperatures. 32 in Amarillo, 37 in Oklahoma City, 47 in Wichita Falls, DFW Airport's 53, still 69 in Austin, but, you know, that cold air is getting, uh, making its advancement pretty quickly to the south and off to the east. Kansas City's down to 27. It's down to 8 in North Platte, Nebraska. We're not going to get that cold, but uh, easily below the freezing mark coming up tonight and staying below freezing again for the morning hours of Sunday. Here's a look at the radar satellite. We have low clouds certainly blanketed across the area, but the showers and storms are to the east, to the northwest. There's a few snowflakes being reported, cold enough for snow, but uh, for us, we'll see temperatures a little warmer. We may catch a stray sprinkle in the afternoon, but for the most part, not great rain chances today at all. Clouds, windy, yes, but generally dry, but our rain chances do go back up by Monday with some rain, cold rain rain coming in. I don't see it cold enough for any wintry precip. 44 for kind of an average afternoon temperature. We're not going to move much today in terms of temperatures. Where we are is pretty much where we're going to stay. Mid 50s around for Saturday, Sunday. We're back back in the 40s and then we work our way slowly back up through the upcoming week with temperatures back into the upper 50s by the time we get to the latter part of the week and then another front comes in. Low temperatures many days below the freezing mark. So if you do have anything outside that can freeze or it can be damaged by the freeze. Uh, be mindful that, of course, it is going to be cold several mornings over the next 10 days, so act accordingly. Future cast for today, clouds certainly stick around through most of the afternoon. Back edge of the clouds late in the day today. We'll hold in the 40s through the afternoon. Tonight, clear sky, cold, 28 degrees. The first freeze coming up for the season for Saturday afternoon, mostly sunny sky, 54 degrees for the high temperature. And then as we go into Sunday, looking at lows in the upper 20s. As we go into Monday, we're going to look for that next storm system to make its way in and hopefully give us an opportunity for some rainfall as we go through Monday. Keep the umbrella handy. It's going to be cold. It's going to be wet. Today, just cold, windy, cloudy temperatures for the most part have already hit their highs. The numbers you see here were from earlier today. We're going to hold pretty much low to mid 40s across the board. Tonight, look at low temperatures, mid to upper 20s. 26 in Lawton tonight, 28 in Wichita Falls, 29 in Seymour. This is not pipe bursting cold, but if you do live in a place that potentially gets a little colder in some of those out, outside walls, you may want to open up the cabinet under your sink to make sure that some of that warmer air circulates in your house. 50s dropping back into the 40s early next week. Another cold rain on the way, but yeah, temperatures are going to stay well below normal over the next seven days. Stay right there. We have more coming up right after the break.